What's good, Skins fans? First of all, man, I haven't brought a trash can in a while, but I'm gonna have to light this joint on fire, for real. And get my lighter out, throw some trash in here, man, and light this joint on fire, because this is what Minuski and, and Josh know right there. I need to light this thing on fire, throw some lighter fluid in this joint, Light this joint on fire, because that's how bad Josh Norman is. Josh Norman and Greg Minuski, they they got to go, man. They got to go. They are that bad. They're that bad. First of all, third and 18. Third and 18. We had an opportunity to actually win this game and come back. Third and 18. We got them third and 18. They get a freaking holding call. Third and 18. Josh, the man runs by Josh Norman. Josh Norman lets him run back, because he always trusts his help. He always trusts his help. Troy Ackby is a little bit on YouTube. But it's, I really just say this. It's, it's probably on Greg Minuski for the play call anyway. But third and 18, how do you let them get a third and 18 conversion? Like, it doesn't make any sense to me. It doesn't make any sense. But, of course, it's Greg Minuski. They need to fire Greg, Greg Minuski today or, or tomorrow morning, man. I, I don't know why he still has a job, man. I don't know why he still has a job. Shout out to the Nationals. If you went to the parade, let me know. Comment if you went to the parade, man. I didn't get a chance to go to the Nationals parade yesterday, but... Uh, Montez Sweat did a good job. He actually had a sack. He finally did something today. Um, Matt Ioannidis had a sack. He did something. Landon Collins actually played well. Um, I think Jimmy Moreland was hurt or something. He was in street clothes. He, he didn't even play. Um, the defense was terrible. I mean, the goal line stay. We had a couple goal line red zone stops. We actually had a stop on fourth and one where I think we went down and we scored a field goal. But we got to stop with the field goals, man. We got to get a touchdown. I don't know why we're not going forward on fourth down. Bill Callahan has been playing a little soft here. Um, shout out to Adrian Peterson. Adrian Peterson played well. He played really, really well. Uh, Bill Callahan has been a little soft. It was fourth and two. We could have went for it. He decided to punt. Um, there was a couple times on fourth down we should have won for it. Man, we have nothing to lose. We're one and eight now. We're one and eight. This is about developing Dwayne Hasses. We don't really, I don't really care about winning games anymore. I just care about developing Dwayne Hasses, putting him in the best position to win. Um, Donald Penn got beat like a drum a couple times. Morgan Moses, once again, looked like he had a PlayStation glitch and stood still. It wasn't bad as the one in the 49ers, but he looked bad. Um, the offensive line is, is scaring me. It's scaring me to the point where I really want to draft Chase Young. But at the same time, if our offensive line is going to play that bad, then we might have to draft a Andrew Thomas. Now, if we get the second or first pick of the draft, then you don't draft Andrew Thomas. And I'll talk about a mock draft, what we should do in the first round and the later rounds in a, in a separate video. But if you get the first pick of the draft... You're going to have to get Chase Young because he's, he's probably the most talented at, or the most NFL ready out of everybody. But a team needs is we really need an offensive tackle, especially with Trent not coming back. He's not coming back. Um, I'm, I'm kind of tired of the Trent situation anyway, with, and it's not his fault. I have Trent's back, but we'll talk about that later too. I'm kind of done with that. Bruce Allen needs to be fired. Dan Snyder needs to sell the team. Um, we'll talk about – and Josh Norman actually got away with the pass interference call. He actually got away with one. He got lucky. Um, he really, really got like it was a pass in the first where he kind of took the guy's legs out. John Brown, thank you for um, being in the live. Whoever's in the live stream, thank you for supporting the channel and watching the live stream. I appreciate that, man. Um, but Josh Norman got away with a lot of stuff. Quinn Dunbar actually got beat a couple times too. This was probably his worst game in my opinion. And um, Josh Allen, he did okay. He really didn't cut us up like that much. Davin Singletary did whatever he felt like doing. They killed us with the screen pass. Um, Manasseh's got to go, man. He's got to go. He's got to go. He's got to go. He needs to be on the first door up out of D.C. Once he gets off that plane, or even before the plane, he needs to be fired. He needs to be fired. Um, now let's get to Dwayne Hassis. I thought he did well. Um, where the Dwayne Hassis haters at? Where y'all at? Where the haters at? Where y'all at? Where, where, did he throw three picks? Did he throw four picks? Did he throw five picks? Like he was supposed to throw five picks. He was supposed to, he was supposed to throw all these interceptions, but I don't see where the interceptions were. He actually did a good job, in my opinion. I thought he did a good job. Um, for the call, for the plays that were called, uh, Bill Callahan obviously didn't want to throw the football. I don't know if Kevin O'Connell was making the play calling, but they obviously didn't want Dwayne Hassis to really throw the ball too much. I thought he did good for the plays that he was given to. He had a nice pass to uh, Steven Sims in the beginning. Had a couple nice passes to Paul Richardson. Um, he did miss some open receivers here and there. The offensive line was trash. He had a nice run. I love that run for the first down. He looked like he was high stepping. He looked like Donovan McNabb. I like it. I like the run that he had. Um, I thought he has a good plays. I think he has a lot of potential. Like I've been saying, he has a lot of potential, man. Um, we do need another receiver. We need another. We need another receiver. Um, receivers were not getting open like that. Um, if you watch on the screen, but Terry Terry had some good plays 
where he did get open, but he just didn't have chemistry with Terry, which he really should have. But some people were saying that Case and Terry have better chemistry and whatnot, which they actually, it looks like it's only been one game, so we'll see. Um, but but Dwayne has a lot of things to build on. He has a lot of things to work on, and he has a lot of um, film that he can look at for the bye week. We do play the Jets, which is actually a winnable game. I'll, I'll say it, you know, I don't think we're going to win either, but it's actually a winnable game. It is. It's a home game against the Jets. The only two winnable games that we have left is the Jets and the Giants, and that's it. Those are the only games that we might have a chance that the Jets are just as bad as us. They really are. They are just as bad. You know, Sam Darnold's a decent cornerback, quarterback. Um, he's very inconsistent, but we'll talk about the Jets in like two weeks um, when the game does happen um, after the bye week. But I like what I saw from Dwayne Hanson. I did. I like. I saw a lot of things that I did like. Um, he threw a nice pass at where Jeremy Sprinkle fumbled the football. Um, Josh Norman, man, he, he just gives us a headache, man. He gives me a headache. We should have just cut him, to be honest with, with you. We should have just cut him, man. We should have just cut him, man. Um, but this game, man, it was it was a rough game. It, it, we really could have won this game. Um, the punting with Tress Wade. It wasn't Tress Wade's fault, but he kept punting into the wind, and the wind would push the ball back. We need to put Steven Sims back there to return punts. Um, but, yeah, it, it, it was a game that we really could have won, but Bill Callahan being soft. In the field position and our defense just giving up too many, too many freaking screen passes. And, and we can't cover anybody, you know. Josh Norman can't cover anybody. It's that bad. It's that bad, man. It's that bad. He's got to go, man. He's got to go. Um, let me know what y'all think about this game. I, I really like what Dwayne Hassis did. I thought he threw some nice passes here and there. Um, they got to take the training ones off. Like I said, it's, it's his first game. No touchdowns, no picks. Um, but I, I thought he played well. I thought he played well for, for the most part. I give him like a B plus. I give him a B plus this game for his first game as a rookie. And the Jets, the Jets, he can have a good game against the Jets. We'll see. He should have a good game against the Jets. For their defense has not been good this year. So um, Dwayne should have a good game against the Jets. And this was the Bills defense that's supposed to be really darn good. And um, Dwayne had some really good plays. The offensive line has been bad though. They were bad today. Donald Penn and Morgan Moses, they were bad, man. They were bad. So. Uh, let me know what y'all think, man. Hail to them skins. Hail to the Nets. Hail to the Wizards. Arch on peace.